Come home to Jupiter and she's thriving in her new role as a baseball executive. ESPN 760's Jason Pugh brings us her story. Over at Roger Dean Stadium in Jupiter, every staff member will tell you that Melissa Cooper has always stood out. You're talking about someone who is a true professional in the industry. Uh, it's, it's a true honor for her to be recognized. Uh, we're very proud of her. I think she's going to represent the Florida State League, you know, Roger Dean Stadium, the Marlins and Cardinals with, with a lot of respect. In her first year as general manager for the Jupiter Hammerheads, Cooper has been nominated for the Rawlings Woman Executive of the Year Award. I actually can't take the credit because it really is um, a team effort. Um, there's a lot that we have to do here. Um, the success that we have here is really attributed to the staff that we have, our fans. Roger Dean is the home of the Hammerheads and Palm Beach Cardinals. The two organizations also have the only two female general managers in the Florida State League. Last year, Lisa Fegley won the same award. It's great to have someone to bounce ideas back and forth with and just see some of the experiences that, you know, she might have had that I hadn't gone through yet or vice versa. Although she wears many hats as general manager of the Hammerheads, at the end of the day, it's all about achieving one goal. Making sure that we provide the best um, experience for fans when they come in here. The winner of the Rawlings Women Executive of the Year Award will be announced in December. I'm Jason Pugh reporting for ESPN 760 on WPTV News Channel 5.